ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೇ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಚಾಕಲ್ಪತುರ್ವಶ್ಯಕಿಪಾಸಿಂದುಭ್ಯ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವಿಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂ ಪಂಗುಂಗ್ಲಂಘಯತಿ ಗಿರ ಯತ್ಕೇಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ಬಂದೆ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಬಿಂದಾವೈ ತುಳಸಿ ದೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸಚ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರಂ ಚೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರಶ್ಯ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರು ಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದರ ಧ್ಯೇಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವನ್ನ ಭವಿಷ್ಯತೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಿರಿಂಚನು ತರಣ್ಯ ಭೀತಾತಿಹಂ ಪುನತಪಾಲ್ಲಭವತಿ ಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೆ ಚರಣಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಮಿ ಗಭವಧೂಷ್ಮದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರ ಸಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕಿ ಪಾಮ ಕರೋಸಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಿಯಾದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಿಯಾದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕ ಬುಧಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನ ಕವಿತರು ಕಮಲ ಹತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರು ದ್ವಿಜವರು ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕ ಬದಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನ ಕಪಿತರು ಕಮಲ ಯಥಾಕ್ಷ ಈಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತೋದಿಪರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಾಸಿ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ ಸದ ನರ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷೀ ತವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವಿಶ್ವನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ಯ ಪದನೆ 
लक्ष्मीश च भक्षसी यस्तेदिंगम हम भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे काले न नष्टा प्रलय बाणी यम मम वेद संगीत काले न नष्टा प्रलय मम बाणी यम वेद संगीत गौरी गोष्ठीपति शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपा जगदगुरु टोल ओ माय फ्रेंड बी केयरफुल यू आर गोइंग टू सच ए कंट्री दे हैव देयर मनी पावर दे हैव देयर फॉल्स इगो They are scientific development, everything very high. Externally, we are from backward country, India. But India is a leading country. India is a leading country, for ever. Though externally you can find their appliances, big appliances, their lifestyle very high, life standard. their education and qualification very high scientific development you are going to such a country for the preaching of chaitanya vani which is really impossible but still possible because we have no self interest if i have my weakness inside my body inside my mind in that case i cannot stand in front of them why people become unsmart why why people become unsmart why because weakness there have some karma why those are sadhu so are so smart why what is the reason because they have no interest they don't fear any situation who can speak good who can speak bad they don't care and they depend upon nitananda balaram that's why they are so powerful they don't fear to speak any absolute truth they are not feeling any shaky mood there are no signs in them pope was speaking their appliances their high lifestyle should not feel should not put an impression into into our heart be careful their high lifestyle their free life different kind of attractive things are there my friend be careful those things is not our ultimate goal our ultimate goal is the lotus feet of goranga mahaprabhu in infinity world such a property like the lotus feet of goranga mahaprabhu i mean krishna is not available but foolish people they have no idea they don't know they are running behind appliances money position so many things they are running so if you are not going to stand in a neutral platform while going to foreign country european country american country externally externally they are advance internally they are zero internally nothing what i can expect from them money or nice lifestyle what i so externally their lifestyle very high their appliances 
the arrangement, aristocracy. But this kind of majestic arrangement, environment, should not put any impression into our heart. Because be careful, we are sadhu. We are going to renounce everything. But we are going to accept which we can engage or apply in case of Gaur Seva. That we can expect. That we can accept. Whichever I can get, if I am going to offer unto the Lotus Feet of Gurudev, Prabhupada, Bhakti Mino Thakur, Nityananda Balura, then there is no question of any attachment. No question of any, any object. You can try in your own life. In your life, you can try yourself. Any objective of feeling attraction, big attraction. It is the teaching of Prabhupada. Tremendous attraction. You don't know why, how to get rid of this attraction. Prabhupada speaking, you can take this item and go on to the lotus feet of Gauranga or Go Krishna and say, I offer to you. Within a few days or immediately, you can free from attraction. In your life, in your life, whatever attractive things are there, whom you love very much, you cannot cut attraction, you can offer. Prabhu, I give it to you. Be it your wife or daughter or husband, anything. That is a procedure. So, Papa speaking, be careful. Otherwise, we will be in big problem. Sometimes they can give honor to you, or sometimes they can reject you, insult you. Because they are not in a position to digest or understand. Bhagavad Tattva is very high sophisticated. Even those who are coming in bhajan, Thousands of people, out of them, one, two, who? Who can understand? So don't worry. Sometimes they can give honor to you, or sometimes kick you. Ah, useless. So honor, position, or insult, all equal for you. Oh, my friend, you should remember, because you are sadhu. All equal for you. With this mood, you can go for pitching, with full patience. If you lose your patience, then you cannot preach. Main quality, before preaching, the main quality you need is your patience, tolerance. Main patience. Tolerance, patience, you need Otherwise, you cannot render. Otherwise, you cannot render any good service to them. Good service means we like to change their heart. We like to make them devotee. They are in hell. They think it is enjoyment. They think it is enjoyment. So, by watching their crazy life, they watch, by watching their dirty life, don't hate them. Don't hate them. Try to love them. Try to love them. Take them in your lap. Then you can change their life. Because love is the only solution. Because love is the only solution all over this universe. Even in infinity world. Only a single solution is love. Without love, there is no solution. If you show love to them with respect to Krishna, then surely today or tomorrow they can give response to you. Or even if not this life, next life they can give response to you. They are going to change body. Same Atma. You are going to change your body. But same Atma, you can meet me. Maybe you met me, met me, previous life, who knows? 
So love is the only solution with full patience, full tolerance. You have to speak Harikatha, Tattva Siddhanta. They have no patience. They have no patience to hear all these secret philosophers. That's why when Prabhupada wanted to ask in front of a Nobel laureate, who that time just came back from outside country, foreign country. He is a poet, famous poet, is now Rabindranath Tagore. Prabhupada asking, you are just coming from European country, American country, you know, England. So what do you think? If I like to send one messenger of Gauranga Mahaprabhu there to teach them, to preach, what do you think? They are useless. Useless. They are not going to hear. They have no time. They don't like to hear. That's interesting. Don't send. Then Prabhupada started speaking Harikatha in front of Ravindranath Thakur by understanding his false mood. Because Rabindranath Thakur cannot understand the intensity of Gaurvani. If I shoot at you, Gaurvani, I can crack, break your heart, I can melt your heart. Don't know. So Popa started speaking Harikatha. After hearing, Rabindranath Tagore was stunned. He's speaking, excuse me. If one preacher like you, going to any country, any time, at any moment, you can come out successful. If you can go any country, any time, any moment, successful, 100%. No doubt in it. Then Prabhupada speaking, I am going to send such a messenger who is as good as me. Like Banu Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti, Sarang Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Padip Tito Goswami Maharaj, they are all going. You can think, if Rani Elizabeth is going to speak, I have no time to hear. Okay, okay, I can, I can, I can hear uh, cross, cross the dinner table. Dinner table I can give you time. Dinner table I am taking, taking food. That time you can speak. Still, Banu Maharaj is not going to lose his patience. It is derogatory. It is insulting. You are taking meat and fish. Eh, eh. And I can speak Harikata in front of you, what you say? Yes, I can speak. Cross the dinner table. Dinner table, big, long table. Banu is sitting here, they are eating meat, feast. Banu is speaking in such a way, after 15-20 minutes, they become impressed, impressing Harikatha. Because if you are Guru Dash, if you are actual servant of Gurudev, then your speech can put one impression into the heart of anybody, be it Elizabeth or king of you know, any country. That's not a big one. Main point is your seva. Your seva can give you power and you can preach. If there is no seva mood, nothing, then you yourself cannot do Harinam Kirtan. It is not effective. You can do, but it is not effective Kirtan. Then how you can, how you can preach? How you can preach? If you have no power, what you can give to common people? If you have yourself, if you have no power, what you can distribute among people, fallen soul. They can give you money. They can give you so many things. But what you can give? What you have? Bhagavan Sri Krishna is speaking that in due course of time, in due course of time, my, my teachings, I mean Veda, Due course of time, due to Kal, Mahakal, it was not destroyed. 
I cannot say Ved was destroyed. Ved is equal to Bhagavan. I cannot say Ved was destroyed due to destruction of the whole creation. Ved is equal to Bhagavan. Bhagavan in Gita speaking, Vedasya Sarvai Rahame Vavidya. Vedasya Sarvai Rahame Vavidya. Ved and me equal. Vedasya Cha Ishwar Atmatvat Tattam Jhanti Surayo. Vedasya Cha Ishwar Atmatvat. Ved and Bhagavan, same. Vedasya Cha Ishwar Atmatvat. Tatra Muyanti Surayo. Those were big, big exalted Pandit. Even in heavenly, heavenly planet, those demigods, they are in confusion about Veda. They cannot understand. So intricate. After reading Veda, are Veda speaking this? Another sadhu speaking, no. Veda speaking this. Veda speaking this, fighting with But they cannot come to conclusion. Even heavenly planet, those demigods. But Bhaktivinoda Tagore can take decision. Bhaktivinoda Tagore can take decision. So he was invited, was, he was invited to heavenly planet. So he was invited by Indra. Come on, but there is one problem, you solve it. Bhaktivinoda Tagore went there in fine form. His body is fine. His total body is fine form. I cannot say this way. Sachidananda. Bhakti Mirtaku. This way, even they cannot take decision about the outcome, conclusion of Veda. I know, I know. Veda speaking so many things. Sometimes Veda speaking, you can do some Arshiv Jagya. Sometimes Veda speaking, you can do this. Sometimes you can do this. You can marry. Ah, you can marry. So many things Veda. But what is the net outcome? Net outcome is that in Veda, this is approved. You cannot, you cannot avoid taking meat, no? You cannot avoid taking meat, no? So, okay. You can offer to Jagya, Sacrifice and then after that. This way, Veda going to put some restriction, rules and regulation to control your to control your unavated desire. To control your unavated desire of free enjoyment. Finally, Veda is going to control you. No, 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 you cannot do. There is restriction, it is not treating Veda. But finally, Veda what going to speak? Veda going to speak that you should understand, you could realize the lotus feet of Krishna. Nothing else. But nobody can realize. Big problem. So, to realize Bhagavatam, to realize Bhagavad Dharma is more difficult for us. Because in bonded condition, we cannot submit properly and so submission is not good. So if submission is not good, Guru Kipa cannot come to me perfectly. If Guru, Guru Kipa is not coming to me, uh, then how I can realize? Because Guru Kipa is the main thing. If Guru Dev is not at all Sadguru, maybe both possibility there. Maybe Guru Dev is not Sadguru or maybe I am coupled. Who can say? My submission is ordered. This way, there is a big problem. But Bhagavan Sri Krishna is speaking to Uddhavji Maharaj. Dharmo Jashyam Madhatma Kaha. Now I am going to speak Uddhav. Dharmo Jashyam Madhatma Kaha. Madhatma Kaha. Now I am going to speak about Bhagavad Dharma. Bhagavad Dharma and I myself non different from me. Dharma Jasam Madhatma Kamin non different from me. I am speaking all about my mystery, all about my everything.
mayado brahmane prakta mayado 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 if you know sanskrit you should realize maya by me maya ado by me brahma was taught mayado brahmane ha eh, dharmo jasya madatma mayado brahmane praktam so first of all bhagavan ki singh kalen anashta pralaye bani yam mam ved sangita mayado at all at all i spoke this tatva vigyan which is the original dharma don't be in confusion if you think there is so many religion in the world it is one kind of confusion for you you can think buddha dharma is okay it's also okay christian dharma is also okay and you can see those who are isai muslim their dharma is also okay what wrong in it yes i am not going to insult i am not going to insult them bhakti vinod tagun never want to insult them bhakti vinod tagun never insulted them in fact in fact there is prohibited according to our own realization power according to their own sanskar according to their own sanskar they are up to this level so why you are going to criticize them christianity okay what problem is it they let them do but you have no right to insult if you can do something out of your kripa you can give them more realization power so that they can realize something more there the dharma we are following now something more there beyond this that you can give you have no right to insult them why you are insulting criticism is not solution they can automatically rely if they go on if they go on hearing if they go on hearing all about bhagavad dharma top philosophy prema gauranga today or to tomorrow i am sure by bhagavad gita speaking they are going to change their heart really so what i can do i can love them i can bless them by the power of gurudev and prabhupad so can so that they can realize their realization power can go more and more more and up and they can realize maharaj today at present what we are following dharma is okay but is not complete they can realize automatically bhakti mal does speaking that bhagavad dharma is the only dharma no alternative you cannot say i can follow bhagavad dharma or i can follow uh, muslim there is no alternative there is no alternative you will have to follow it's a must one has to one has to follow this procedure or today you are fighting okay you can die next year next bar next bar infinity bar. after that you are bound to where you can go finally you have to come to through this channel finally you are bound to come one has to come this channel but no other channel so bhagavad dharma can never be compared with other dharma it is derogatory because it is the only dharma in infinity world infinity brahmanda what to speak about infinity brahmanda even in vaikuntha even in golokdam only one and single dharma going vaikuntha also bhagavad dharma going they are bhagavat all bhagavat devotees are bhagavat dharma. in golokdam also there where you can go wherever you go in infinity world bhagavad dharma is the only dharma of your spirit not your body now you are busy with your body material body material mind now you are captivated by maya now you are captivated by maya but if you can realize 
that what is the dharma of soul? All dharma you bring, I can show more or less, more or less, they are dealing with material body and mind. They are not going to deal with the absolute Atma. More or less, any religious book you bring, I can show you, more or less, they are dealing with this material body and, and mind. They are not going, going to give absolute importancy for the benefit of that Atma, spirit which is eternally present. So, Atma is eternally present, so the Dharma of Atma is also eternally present. If Atma is eternally present, then the Dharma of Atma cannot be fragile for the time being as Atma can do this and tomorrow Atma can do Not that. Atma is eternal, so the Dharma of Atma is also eternal. That's why Jesus is in Atma Dharma, Bhagavad Dharma, Jaiva Dharma, so all synonym. So we cannot consult anybody. Eh? We cannot insult anybody. Today or tomorrow, they can go on hearing about Gauranga or Bhagavan Singh, all secret Siddhanta relating to Atma. I'm 100% sure, I have so many confidence that they can, today or tomorrow, they can realize, Maharaj, this is Dharma. This is the only dharma. That's why Bhagavan Sikh is now speaking to Uddhavji Maharaj. Uddhav. Kalena nashta pralayam mama bani veda sangitam. Mayado brahmane prakta dharma yasyam madatma kaha. At all I told to Brahma. And before that, in course of time, I mean destruction. Veda, nobody can remember. Because Veda is not such an object, but because of the total destruction of this universe, Veda also destroyed. How we can say? Veda can never be destroyed. No. Veda missing. Veda missing. Veda destroyed means Bhagavan is destroyed. Then you are Mayavadi. Kongso wanted to destroy Krishna. Kongso, idiot number one, foolish, don't know. Krishna can never be destroyed. This is the Ravan like to like to abduct Sita. I mean the Sharup Shakti of Ram. Want to kill Ram, Ram, destroy Ram, or how possible? He is Bhagavan Paratwara Kilishwar eh, Ananta Brahmana Nath. How you can kill him? Infinity Brahmanda controlled by Bhagavan Phu running all infinity Brahman, like dust particle. If you take some dust particle in hand, dust particle, infinity Brahmanda, resting in Mahavishnu. How you can destroy Mahavishnu? It's possible? So, big problem. Bhagavan speaking, in course of, so in course of this, in course of this, you know, time, in course of time factor, because time and tide wait for now, for infinity flow time going on. Who can calculate when? You and me, you and me can go away from this material world. Somebody can come again, fulfill the blank, fill up the blank, na? How long you can live? How will I will have to go away from this material? Some new generation can come. Again, they can go away. Again, New Jerusalem. This is a fact. So, Bhagavan is going to speak very specifically. Dharmu yasam madatma. Mayado brahmane prakta. I at all told to Brahma. Really so? Chatusrake Bhagavad already we know. Mayado, at all. I told to Brahma. And before that, Veda was missing. If you go through Bhagavatam, I can show you. I can show you how Vedu was rescued. Vedu was there, missing. Hayagrib, 
one daita wanted to destroy and to take away. Uh, I give Bhagavan wanted to taking, uh, you know, uh, the uh, sarup of horse wanted to collect, you know, snatch Veda from Asura. Long thing, he says. So, first uh, point is that due course of time, Veda was missing, so people forgot everything, but it is eternally present. It can never be destroyed. May um, Adu, I at all told to Brahma, uh, and what dharma you told to Brahma? What dharma you told to Brahma? Dharmo yasham madatma kaha. Dharmo yasham madatma kaha. That dharma and me, non-different. All other dharma, any dharma, Bhakti Vintagu told, like you like to come to me, you come to me, na? from ground floor, you will have to step up one by one step. Na? Then you can come to the second floor, then you can enter. Bhakti Vinta is going to give explanation. In Jaima Dharma, we have no right to insult any Dharma. But one thing sure, all Jivatma, infinite world, there cannot be diversified Dharma. There cannot be diversified dharma for different, different people. If one dharma is applicable for you, if another dharma is applicable for you, another, another dharma applicable for me, then we can take it granted there can be countless Bhagavan. We can take it, there can be count, because your Bhagavan is separate, your dharma, my dharma. So we are going to accept there is countless dharma, countless Bhagavan. Not that. Leo Tolstoy or anybody, not only Leo Tolstoy, all, everybody, all big, big, talented personality in the world who take birth, they all together, they confess there is one and a single Bhagavan. There is one and a single Bhagavan. We, we according to our foolishness, we, according to our foolishness, going to obey this, this, that, fight with you, fight with that. But they cannot be... There is one and a single point. All big, big, talented personalities say, eh? we think, we, we realize, there is one, one and a single point of this infinity universe. Sure. And Bhagavan cannot be infinity. Bhagavan is one. Now point is, who is that Bhagavan? Who can catch? Who can catch? By reading this Dharma Gantha, by reading this religious book, you can reach up to Bhagavan? You can show me? Who reach Bhagavan? Only way. All the Rishi Manis, they are going to show, there is one and single Bhagavan, India is a land of spiritual cultivation. India is a land of spiritual cultivation. Those sages, after long deliberation, have given us immense treasure of knowledge. But we are so foolish, we are not going to concern. We are not going to respond to Sadhguru Vaishnava. They can give even Bhagavan. What to speak about money, position, man, woman? It's a cheap thing. Even they can give Bhagavan to you. Krishna se tomar, Krishna dite paro. While doing kirtan, you are doing kirtan, not realize. A written in kirtan. Krishna se tomar, Krishna dite paro. Tomaro shakati ache. Krishna is yours. You can give Krishna to me. But you sing kirtan, but no realization. In kirtan, we are doing kirtan, but no one is. Ah, oh, Gurudev. You can give Krishna, so there is no surety when I can give Krishna. Better I can enjoy something. Why should I run behind uncertainty? Who told you I am running? Who told you, idiot, I am running behind uncertainty? Without any goal, without a perfect confirmation, surely I am not, not running towards the Bhagavad Dharma. Be sure, I am not foolish. I have taken decision. Final decision after final realization. 
My decision is not fluctuating like you. You can think this is under break and make, make and break and make. You can take decision and break, break and make. No. 100% sure my goal is fixed, target. So, like one, you know, in the sky we find one star, Dhruva Tara, one special star in north direction. So, when you are confusion, where am I? You will have to. You have to see the star. The star is north direction you have to go. Special star. It's called Shukatara in Sanskrit and Bengali. So, Bhagavan Sri Krishna is going to speak this way. That Dharma Jasam Madhatpaka. There is a one and single Dharma, be sure, be sure by touching Bhagavatam. There is one and single dharma, that is called Bhagavad dharma, that is called Atma dharma. I mean the dharma of your Atma. Dharma, not because there is so many dharma. Some dharma going to deal with your body, some dharma going to deal with, deal with your mind, some, some dharma going to deal with some uh, social reformation, some ritualistic activities, all going to put you in bondage. All ultimately going to put you in bondage. There is no solution. So if you like, if you are really interested, so if you are really interested about your Atma, then I would request you that you should follow Atma Dharma, which is going to deal, which is going to deal purely, purely which is going to deal with only your the interest of your Atma. Only the interest of your Atma. That you can follow. And I can put guarantee in stamp paper. I can sign. You can come out successful. Nobody can give guarantee. I can give you print paper. I can signature give. Provided you are going to obey me. I can give you guarantee. So much assurance there. I am not running behind one uncertainty. Not that. So, we find in Bhagavatam that Gokarnaji Maharaj, Gokarnaji Maharaj, a great devotee, Mahabhagavat, who is a son of Atmodev. I already touched this point, but this point I never discussed. Atmodev Ji Maharaj, wanted to find some solution, permanent solution in his life because he is now in problem. He wanted to take decision to lead his family life very nicely. Some children, wife, wife is there, some children I can get, I can enjoy my life. This is called grace of life. <clears throat> but finally, <clears throat> he was feeling disturbance. He was feeling disturbance because that Dundukari, a very dangerous son. Dundukari, anyway, going to put father, mother all in problem. All money, property, all gone. Because he is habituated to go to frost quarter, these, that, drinking wine, steal, so many things. So his life is horrible now. Going to beat mother, taking big, big streak and beat father and mother. Now Atmadev Ji, now Atma, now Atmadev, now Atmadev Ji thinking, Oh my God, this is the reason for why I wanted to commit suicide. I mean to get one children. This is the reason? Oh my God. I have done a great mistake, Bhagavan. Great mistake, if at all, if at all I am, I ha if at all I have no children, it is good for me. But I mistakenly have taken decision. It was my false ego, I like to get children, children. Ch what you can do with children? Children, you know about Chitta Raja? He also crying. 
Yeah, I like to check. I like to get children. What you can do? Baby. Seven life, seven life can secure no children in you. No, I like to get children. You will have to give out your out of your bhajan power. Finally, what happened? Finally, what happened? Angirajasi given uh, some aushadi you can give. Arrange one jagya, arrange one jagya. So in Veda also it is. You can do this jagya so you can get children. So surely it is the, it, so surely it is the, uh, it, it cannot be the ultimate target of Veda. Just to guide small children, don't understand. Not to guide them, okay. Finally, when they, when they, when they can grow their conscience, they cannot use useless. Because there is different kind of grade of Jivatma. Who is there in which grade? Where? According to that, they will have to, they will have to get some support, na? Everybody not in the same platform. So for them, at least something should be there. So accordingly that, like a mother, like a mother are going to apply, might to give bitter medicine to the children and baby. But there's a small boy not ready. No, I cannot. Bitter, very bitter. Mother fighting with the boy. You have to take. Finally, mother took decision. He is very fond of laddu, sweet ball. So I can show you. There is sweet ball, huh? You kept for you. Give, give, give. No, not now. Sweet ball I cannot give right now. First of all, you have to take medicine. After that, I can give you sweet ball. The boy is there. <laughs> what to do? Sweet ball, the lucrative, lucrative offer. Finally, you are okay, okay, give me medicine. Medicine taking. After that, mother giving sweet ball. This is the target of Veda. Veda is surely not going to misguide you. But what to do? You are like a small boy, not going to obey. So finally, uh, you do it. This, this, that. Finally, they can, at least they can go. At least they can go forward. That is the reason for, you, for why you are getting so many, uh, so many offer, so many offer in Veda. That is the reason for why you are going to get so many offer in Veda. That is the reason. Veda never like to misguide you. Marriage arrangement there, but without marriage they can do all rubbish activities. So better they can marry. Regulated life. That's why. This way, Veda guiding, people cannot understand. So, this Chitra Ketu Raja, he is crying and uh, catching the lotus feet of Angiraris, you will have to arrange. Without children, without baby, I cannot live. <coughs> Angirarishi was finally bound, he was finally bound to arrange one Jagya. Putreshri, it is name is Putreshri Jagya. After Jobuk, Jagya is over, after Jagya is over, he is going to take one bowl, pot of Paramanna, I am going to give. You can give this Paramanna to your first, first queen, principal queen. Queen, so many queen. So she can give birth to one. But this boy can become the reason both for your enjoyment and, and misery. But the king cannot understand. King, king, king was not in a position to pay attention to this word. Rishi already told, these children, this baby, will become, will become the reason of your enjoyment and pain, both. But the king could not pay attention. He is enjoying, oh, baby will be there, oh, baby. After that, baby took birth. Really? After that, really baby took birth. And the king is, you know, dancing. King is dancing like mad. Ah, oh, I have a very taking a lap and kissing. My boy, my boy. <laughs> so much enjoyment. 
After that, what happened? All other wives, all other wives, because only one wife going to take one children, but all other wives, they are neglected. All other wives, they are feeling neglected. They are, they are feeling very pain. Huh? King now having one baby of the first you know, queen, and he is going to uh, pay attention to the first queen. The, we are also queen. The king not going to pay attention. We are neglected. So they took decision. Better we can apply poison to the small baby so that baby can die. Again we can enjoy the same right. So what to do? You see the arrangement of Maya. In the name of milk, applying poison to the small baby, baby die. What you can do? Already Angira she told na die. When king king came to know that your boy is already <coughs> die, then the king jumped from the high throne like mad, all clothes and like mad running, all clothes, all co you know, crown all fall down like mad, running and running and. And jumping into the body of that boy. My boy, my boy, my boy, my father, you cannot go here leaving me. Impossible. I cannot live without you. But a dead body is dead body. Not going to give any response. Dead body can give a response? No. Mahaprabhu also done. Here in Siva Sangan. Siva Sangan, na? Mahaprabhu doing Shankita in the meantime. The son of Sivas Pandit gone. Mahaprabhu was saying, today I am not getting enjoyment. What happened? Nothing happened. Why? Something happened. Today I am not getting enjoyment. Finally it was discovered, the son of Sivas Pandit gone from him. Mahaprabhu was going to touch the body of that dead body and speaking, Hey! Why you are going away leaving this uh, nice arrangement? Mahaprabhu touching the body of the dead body, I mean the boy. Jivatma, why you are going a nice arrangement at the bank of Ganga, so many? All, whatever duty I had, Malda, this much relation. Now I am going to some other place. The Atma speaking, I am going to some other place. Now no more. This way, your children, I mean boy, son, daughter, husband, they are going, leaving this body. Now he is not your husband. No more you can say, he can take another, that Jivatma can take another body. You cannot go to that house and say, he is my husband. You cannot say. Because body is husband. Body is husband. The conception is body is husband. Who is husband? Who is husband? Who is son? Who is children? Who is mother? Who is father? Huh? For some time being. Huh? For 60 years, for 50 years. For 20 years, he is a relationship, he is a father and son. It's one kind of drama, you know, drama going on. So one player coming here, he play this. After that he gone, Scene, I mean scenery change, another an actor coming, is doing it. It is just like a platform on which I am playing the role of this. You are playing the role, different, different role you are playing. There is one kind of stage, you know, stage. There is one kind of stage where there is drama going on and you are playing the role of, you know, this, I am playing the role of this, this is a drama. Nothing else. So Mahaprabhu calling the Jivatma and Jivatma coming, hey Jivatma, you can stay here. No, my duty is over here. I'll have to go to some other place. Jivatma God. Everybody could realize Emotion should be thrown out. Because emotion is not devotion. Emotion should be thrown out. What emotion? Sentiment, false ego, emotion, what is No use. Similar way, Angira Rishi and Naraji also coming. What happened? What happened to you? Why you are coming king? My son gone from this world. I cannot talk, I cannot be a spy, like mad. Like mad. 
Then Naraji Angiri is calling, Hey Jivatma, come. Jivatma again coming to this body for the time being. Why you are going to leave this kind of great appliances? Is king all over the world. Chitta Ketu. Why you are going to do so much uh, majestic arrangement, you know? Oh, Jivatma speaking, now my duty is over. Now my duty is over here. No, no, I cannot say anymore. <clears throat> I'll have to go to some other place. Then Jivatma, after speaking some words, a few, after speaking a few words, Jivatma again gone. <clears throat> when after speaking some words, Jivatma again gone, then Chittagutu, Chittagutu Raja was shocked. Oh, this is the calculation of life. Oh my God, I was foolish. This is the life. Jivatma coming to one body and become my son, daughter, after that going away and going to become husband of somebody, father of... Oh, this is the calculation of life. This is the appropriate, this is the appropriate, this is the appropriate calculation of life. Oh my God. Oof. Then he going to stop crying. Going to stop crying. Now no crying. He could understand that he could understand the mystery. He could understand the mystery of life. Life and death. If you can realize the if you can realize if you can realize the mystery of birth and death, if you can understand the mystery of birth and death, birth and death. If you can realize the eternal duty of your Atma, you can never try to fight with me. I'm sure. If you are foolish, then you can fight with me. I am not going to protect your material interest. Your nice fooding and lodging. Surely I am not going to protect your material interest. I am going to protect your absolute interest but you become angry with me. That is the main problem. So, people even like to beat a sadhu. Like their Haridas Thakur, what he has done. What mistake Haridas Thakur done the sword so that they took decision to beat Haridas Thakur heavily to kill him. Why? Because those sadhu, those who are pure sadhu, I already told that they those who are pure sadhu, they are speaking in the absolute truth. They become the target of attack of the whole world. Nobody wants that. He is speaking this way, this way, that way. Always going to find fault with no fault. He is going to speak the fact. Fault, not fault. Fault and fact. You can start with F. Fault. F-A-U-L-T. <laughs> fact. F-A-C-A-T. Fact. Fault and fact are not the same. We are foolish. To speak about the absolute truth, to point out your problem, is not criticism. Criticism is very dirty. Come on. Criticism is very dirty. It is not good. Because there is no high idealism. There is no idealism. Criticism is coming out of envious attitude. I am going to criticize you because I envious attitude. Ah, useless. Criticism is dirty. Criticism, a criticizer should be given punishment. Should be not going to get punishment. Criticism and, you know, to speak about the absolute truth, to point out your fault, don't do that, you go there. Not same, but whole world in confusion. They are speaking his criticism. High idealism of sadhu. Why go? Why Pope is going to speak? Don't do that. Don't do that. This one. No, don't go there. Why? Pope is going to criticize somebody. Or going to point out, arrest our fault, and try to deliver us. This is your dirty mentality. This is a dirty mentality, speaking this way. 
Yeah, Prabhupada. Prabhupada always criticized. Prabhupada was speaking this way. Why? We are also doing bhajan. Come on. We are also doing bhajan. You can do your bhajan in your... Tomorrow I can discuss. What all Sahaji are speaking to Prabhupada. You can do your own bhajan. Why you are... You do your own bhajan. You have no bhajan. Only you are going to speak this. But they don't know what is bhajan. My speaking about the absolute truth, my speaking about the absolute truth, absolute way, my speaking to point out your fault, to rectify the whole world, is called bhajan. It's called actual bhajan. You give me permission, very easily, I can close the door. Two months, six months, it don't open. If you like to put challenge, I can accept. Because it is, I already done it. It is not problem for me. You can put under lock and key. I can say under six months. I cannot say anybody's face. I promise you. Because I have done it. <clears throat> Two months, continuously. One room, nobody there. I am not passing lecture. If I am going to pass lecture, then I can get punishment. <clears throat> it's good for me. Because I can get the association of Guru Bhargava. You can find Maharaj in lonely room. In forest, here, there. But I am not in forest. I am in front of devotees. I don't like to go to forest. If I at all like to go to forest, I like to go to forest Vindavan. Like I told you, no? Pallad Maharaj speaking, Banam Gataha, I like to make one joking, very nice. Pallad Maharaj wants to indicate that if you at all going to go to forest, you can go to forest Vindavan. Because you can get all devotees there. Forest, okay. Prahlad Maharaj can mean this. Who can say? If Prahlad Maharaj can speak the name of Krishna, whereas Krishna was not there present that time, it was Satyaju. So why not Prahlad Maharaj cannot know about Vrindavan? If, if Prahlad Maharaj can know about Krishna, surely Prahlad Maharaj can know about Vrindavan, about Radharani. Why not? Why not? So I wanted to mean that way yesterday. So Prahlad Maharaj very secretly wanted to point out if you want to get the highest benefit, the topmost benefit, then you will have to get Prema, Krishna, Prema, you go and run into Vrindavan. So both ways I can find solution. If I am going to Vrindavan, it is forest, at the same time I can get the association of Sadhu. So both ways solution. Both ways solution, no? I cannot go to Vrindavan. I cannot go to forest. I cannot go to forest in bonded, bonded condition. It's prohibited. But Pallad Maharaj speaking, you can go to forest to get the highest benefit, topmost benefit. So both are solution. I cannot go to Vrindavan. I cannot go to forest. But I can go to forest Vrindavan. I, I surely, surely I cannot go to forest, any forest in this bonded condition. It is not permitted. But I can go to forest Vrindavan. Because anyway, to go to Vrindavan means Bhagavan Sri Krishna was speaking to Uddhava, Banam tu Shakti Kambhasam, to stay with Sadhu Guru Vaishnava. So if I go to forest Vrindavan, there is Sadhu Guru Vaishnava there, Brajavasi. So what wrong in it? Both are solution coming. Both are solution coming, na? So what problem? So this way, now Chitta Kriti Raja could realize life is unstable. No surety. Every now and then there is one kind of danger in life. I am running, I am going, I am walking down the street, some car can come and bam! I die. What surety? Even one, even one fraction of second before, you could not realize that some car can come and collide with my car, I can die. This is the this is your life, <clears throat> uncertain. So those who are really intelligent, they like to go to Vrindavan to do Parikram. I can come to this point, evening time. So, to stop Sangshar Parikram, to, to, do, to stop Parikram for infinity period, we are doing Sangshar Parikram. Now we don't like to do Sangshar. Enough of it. Now I like to enter into Vrindavan to do Parikram. 
Shashat Katu Raja, Chitta Kaju Reza was in, now was in a stable position. He started doing Japa Mantra. By the help of that mantra, within seven days, he could see the lotus feet of Anantadev. The mantra was given by Naraji Maharaj. Naraji Maharaj told, you can chant this mantra day and night. Day and night, continuously. Within seven days, I promise you, you can get the darshan of Anantadev. Really so? And Anantadev going to give him the responsibility, leadership, leadership, leadership of higher planet. Leadership. Anantadev give him. Vidyadhar. You know, Vidyadhar, Charan, Kinnar. You don't know, never heard. Foolish. Vidyadhar, Charan, Kinnar. Eh? They are dancing, somebody, some speaking, Shastra, some playing musical instrument, upper planet. Gandharva, Vidyadha, Charan, is there, upper planet. So, he was given, he was given the total leadership. He was given the total leadership of, of Vidyadha. So great. Follow. Now, our father of Atma, Father of Gokarnaji Maharaj, Atmadev was fed up. He wanted to find something. My son, I have done mistake. I wanted to commit suicide. To get, I wanted to commit suicide. Without children, I cannot live. Without children, it is horrible for me to live anymore. So I went to forest to convince her. But by chance I get children, now it is more horrible. That time my conception was different. Now I am going to commit suicide because why I have children? Why I have no children? Now why I have children? Because my children, my son is, uh, you know, is become the cause of my pain. Then Gokarnaji Ma is crying. Father, Atmadev Ji crying in front of Gokarna Ji. Gokarna Ji. Because Gokarna Ji is the topmost devotee. First, first Bhagavad session, you know, first Bhagavad session was there in Shuktal Khetra, in, in this world. I am not speaking about other world. In this world, after creation, after creation, in this world, First Bhagavad session was there in Shuktal. I mean, Shukdev Goswami speaker and Parikir Maharaj going to hear. Second Bhagavad session was there held at Naimish Aranna, at the bank of Gomati Ganga. Twenty years back I went there, like vagabond, like mad. No money, nothing like mad. I went there. I realized. Now I have no time, I have no interest. All done by Bhagavan, by the desire of Bhagavan. I was crazy. Second Odivation. And first Odivation, 88,000. Second Odivation, six, uh, no. Se second Odivation, 88,000. First Odivation, 60,000. Many issues. Third, third elevation, we have no calculation. Third elevation was done by Gokarnaji Maharaj Ki Jai. Gokarnaji Maharaj done. He started speaking Harikatha at the bank of Kaveri. Speaking Harikatha. In front of countless. Why? Because Dhundukari was killed, murdered. Hundukari was killed by some pros. Some group of pros, they wanted to take decision to kill him and take all golds and enamel from him. He was killed and not only that, his body was given under one cavity. They make one cavity, they kill, they kill with, you know, with, Iron bar, 
hot iron bar, mouth, killing him. After that, they already, it is pre-planned. It was already pre-planned. They make one cavity, they went to take the body and put in the cavity and um, they are going to put mud so that nobody can understand. It's ground and put some plant, you know, some small one, trees, so that nobody can express any doubt. But he become ghost. He become ghost, you know. Then now ghosts are running here and there. Who can, in our, this world, in this world, some ghost, his a, some ghost is there. Makkah, Madina, here, there are so many. Some of them, 500 years. Some of them, 2,000 years. Some of them, 3,000 years, 5,000. Old, they are not delivery. Who can deliver them? Who can deliver them? They are in the form, they are in the form of ghost. I can take you to one place in Rajasthan. I can take you to one place of Rajasthan. A Hanuman Mandir. Big Hanuman Mandir. Famous all over the world. If you take, if you take those who are going to offer to Hanumanji Maharaj, if you take that prasadam, immediately you can, you know, because those prasadam are offered to ghosts. Hanumanji Maharaj, there was a corridor, big corridor, nobody going there. A roof. Hanumanji Maharaj Prasadam, they give to those ghosts. They are taking Prasadam. If you go there, big problem. Madina, if you go to Madina, every now and then you can... Madina, Makkah Madina, you heard? Neman, a foolish. Makkah, Makkah. Those who are going to do Hajj, Makkah Madina, adjacent. If you go to Madina, Every now and then you can meet with ghost. Every now and then. In Chagda also, in a very early in the morning, winter season, I took decision to go uh, to some place very early in the morning. The previous day Harikata was over. I am going with luggage, but I wanted to make a shortcut. I wanted to make a shortcut. Come on, I get no car, nothing, morning time. So I took decision to go to this, you know, some, it is not forest actually, it is uh, nobody going to go, I wanted. I go two steps, I find long host. Somebody going to clean that ground. I say, this is a useless place. This is useless place, only bamboo, bamboo, only bamboo all around. Who they are? Clean this ground? No need? Then I said, who are you? There, I started like a lion. They are speaking, we are here, come. I said, idiot, I know who we are, who you are, I know. I, immediately I took decision to come just backward. I mean, this direction. If you look backward, then problem can come. After watching ghost, if you are going to broadly, you are going to front way, it's okay. If you're going to look back, they can catch you. Of course, they cannot catch me. Not possible. Not possible. One long ago, maybe 12, 15 years back, I was doing parikram. Some devotee was there with me backside. He cannot walk so fast. I find one man is in the road very early in the morning, four o'clock. Four o'clock in Bindavan darkness. I took decision to go early in the morning. It's more practical. Before sunrise, sun is scorchy, hot. I can travel so much. But I find one man is you know, running. I find the man is just here. I find the man just here. Many, just a, uh, one meter. After that, we find the man is a hundred meters away. I mean, what is this? Just the man is a hundred, one meters away. How possible hundred meters I find? It must be ghost. <laughs> this way. So what I say, now Gudundukari was murdered, Dhindukari was killed, so he became ghost. Who can deliver? Kokornoji Maharaj, 
you know, going to travel all different pilgrimage. He wanted to offer funeral cake to Gaya in the name of Dundugari. He has no information where Dundugari gone. Finally coming back to the village to have a look. Finally coming back after all pilgrimage, you went to uh, come back to the old uh, place to have a look what is then that ghost going to catch him, I mean request him, night time. You please save me. Who are you? Aham bhata tadiyasmi dhundukari tinamataha. That ghost speaking, that ghost speaking, Aham bhata tadiyasmi dhundukari tinamataha. Shakye naiva doshena brahmattam nasitam maya. I am finished. I am gone to hell. I am your brother. Your brother? Yes, my name is Hundukari. You are brother, you are ghost. Why are you offered, you know? Then there was Bhagavad Katha. That was the third session. I can come to the point someday, no time today. So, before going to pil pilgrimage, before going to pil pilgrimage, Father Atmodev wanted to get some solution from son. My son knew. I am fallen into hell. I am fallen into darkness. I am fallen into darkness. Please save me. Then Dhandukari, uh, uh, Dhandukari no. And then, then Gokarnaji Maharaj going to advise to father. What is that advice? I can discuss. Tomorrow, today, no time. I can discuss with this point. Anyway, so... You should not forget that point. Kalena nashta prale bani iyam mama beda sangitam. Mayado brahmane prakta dharma yasyam madatma kaha. Bancha kalpadurva sikipa sindhubhaj. Patitanang pavane bhavishna. With full attention. I promise you, those who are going to hear with full attention, your, this life is end. You need not take birth anymore. If you hear with full attention, otherwise I cannot take responsibility. Realize, huh? Something? 